goblins ahead. A war drum. One of those. Look it, Claw. Sapper's here. Unless you've got another reason to be here. Feck sight. Let's try to be diplomatic, shall we? Goblins don't come by the handfuls, but by the dozens. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Authority. This better not be Minfara's messenger. If the boss finds out I gave her a hard time, that's me done. Oh, right. Beg pardon. Gotta give all the visitors the old squinty eye, you know. Uh, go on in and have a drink for me, eh? Who? If he ain't one of us and if he's here, he's down in the pits. The pits? He couldn't be somewhere pleasant sounding, could he? Better still be alive. Heh! <laughs> Depends who you are. We're celebrating a raid! No better time in camp than this. Get yourself a bit of fun before it dries up. Rip the guts out of Joaquin's rest, we did. Inns are good for gutting. Lads even captured some Duke. Worth celebrating, that is. With haste. Next time, Crib will be on guard, you. Right, boss? Rip couldn't guard his nose from his fingers. Blessed be the absolute! Hey, Grip moaning. Blessed be. And the knoll gnawed her arm clean off. So much for the flaming fist, eh? You ain't here. We sapped Joaquin's rest and left it to burn. Drow flinging magic. No snapping off heads. In's nothing but a pile of ash by now. Glorious. Bunch of prisoners got towed to Moonrise. City snobs mostly. But the flaming fist? Pile of smoking corpses. You ain't know the broken road? Meh. <laughs> I'll tell you real slow, like, so you don't miss it. No. So 
sounds like they're Goblin captured Kai. themselves. A red and shut it! His what name kind of is Draw Ranks and his voice absolute! Or what? The true souls are coming! They're loudness of far! A stranger in our fair camp. Here follow, I cry far and wide for great glory. Draw Raxlin's best fake as a blade in the quarry. For kind or be you be hated. Goblin kind will tease you and throat you and red as you Kill him? His name is Draw Raxlin. Ah. A disgusting waste of stonecraft. Cautious. Goblin kind will tease you and throw you in a voice of absolute. His troops will disarm you and draw you the truth. He looks right at me. Not with dare, require of you. A new age is dawning with confidence and trust. 
It's just bloody quiet. Mountains, great mortals, all vendors to quake. The true souls are coming, the loudness awake. This should burn going down. Oh, for real, lads. I propose a toast. 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 A toast to our victory and many more to come. <laughs> Tonight Duke's face when we gave him to the drow! Keep that bird away from the merchandise. We're just standing here all dry for. Come here, have a drink! What should we toast to, eh? Guys! This one's given us a toast. You raise your glass and shout. Yeah. Finding those looters and crushing them. Go on, drink up. That's it. Down the hatch. <laughs> now get out of my way. Oh, I need another drink. <laughs> you poisoned us. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. I didn't know. I swear I didn't know. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Whack it. Oh, come on now. They're just having a bit of fun. Oi, so much fun. Oi, ain't no party in here. We're doing the absolute's work. State your business, now. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. the first foreign type, I suppose. Gonna have to be a bit more specific though, mate. Absolute's got a few favourites around here. You here to see Priestess Gut, Boss Raxlin, or the Drow? Audience is right. She's an uppity one and no mistake, but she knows her business. She's in telling the war chiefs what's what. 
Next raid's gonna be a big one, I hear. Bloody racket! So Luna, as if mingling with a horde of goblins wasn't bad enough. Let's do what we have to do, then get out of here. Good. I wasn't intending to. That'll be some real fun! <laughs> Here's somebody special. The Absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. A priestess? One of the leaders, no doubt about it. Let's make her squeal. What's that? Tell your friend to keep quiet, or he'll lose his good eye. Ready for the fire, are ya? Yeah. Yeah. Shows our devotion to the Absolute. These maggots see how strong we are with her guidance. Whole camp will be branded soon, and you should be too. You ready? Brace yourself, this'll sting. Hold still. As pain muddles your thoughts, your minds become entangled. A familiar sensation. She too carries a parasite. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Her faith floods into you, a tide of shuddering ecstasy. Her tadpole nestles within that mania, secure, hidden. I feel you in there, digging around. Works both ways. And I saw some weird shadows swimming around in your head just now. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. Of course. Don't want this rabble interfering with true soul business. Let's go to my chapel. Two souls Princess, are affected like us. We want the mark. Why do they yeah. think they're talking to a god? Aren't we good enough for the absolute? At least give me a sword. We want you. That the jingle of coin I hear? You've timed it well, my friend. Already turned quite the profit today, so I'm feeling generous. You recognize the crest she bears, the winged serpent of the Zentarim. Half right, sharp eyes. A Zen is a normal trader, just a matter of what's for sale. 
Weapons and other exotic goods, true enough. But most of all, we offer discretion. No judgment, no right and wrong, just good deals and bad. That problem for you? Bit quieter, if you please. This crowd just burned that into the ground, you might recall. But good. That means Zaris and her little operation weren't found. Seems you're a friend of the family. That warrants a discount. A small one. Violence hasn't gone unnoticed. It's about to be returned in kind. in that corpse. You should take a look. This one is a true soul parasite. It can enhance you. You can absorb its potential. Open your mind to it. You already know how. Your mind swells as it subsumes everything the tadpole has to offer. Everything it was and everything it was destined to be. Pure potential. Pure power. Good. You have grown your power and improved your chances of survival. Give you peace, you know. But no, you gotta keep silent, don't you? Where do they flee to, you stubborn rat? Please, stop! Here to see your friend, have you? Come and join him if you like. Say we'll take over. 
His work is sloppy. He'll kill the prisoner too quickly. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. him ah, take him won't do you any good he just screams ah, should have sent him to moonrise with the rest for all the good he's beaten i want to watch that weird priest next door sounded like he was beating something up oh <laughs> yeah beating it good what the prisoner Please, please, let me out. There's no reason for this. The lock clicks and opens. Thank you. I, I, I better go before they catch us. I should be able to make it to the grove on my own. They need to know they're in danger. Elsin! I... I don't know. He changed into a bear, but I lost sight of him. I don't know if he's still alive. The, the grove, to the east. They wanted to know where we came from. No, they'll, they'll kill everyone. Please, I need to warn them. We, uh, I was with a group of adventurers. We came here for an artifact. It's called the, the Night Song. We tried to sneak past the goblins, but they ambushed us. I didn't think a pack of goblins could be so, so efficient. I don't know. The boss didn't say. He just said some wizard called Laroakin would reward us if we found it. It should be here somewhere. He said there was a hidden passage underneath the temple. The place was supposed to be abandoned, but when we arrived, <sighs> Brian had instructions, but Goblins got him. They... They said they eat him. I... I have to go. I have to get out of here.
Greetings, child. I've met few aside from goblins here. You recognize the Scourge. This man is a follower of Leviathan, goddess of pain. Ah, are you also here to assist with the prisoner? Your tastes must turn to the exotic if you would stop here by choice. I was invited to discuss pain and its intricacies. But even I find these goblins crude and, well, primitive. Pain without purpose is a terrible thing. Wouldn't you agree? You know the Maiden of Pain. How refreshing. But there is more to us than that. Yes, we worship her through pain, often our own, but it is an intimate and loving thing, one we offer up. If you would permit it, I can show you firsthand. I wouldn't let his skilled hand anywhere near me. Is that a promise? Oh, a pity, though. You would have known such sweet relief at my hands. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should return to my own worship. Peggy, if you're lying. Give me a sword! We want you dead, you dumb knuckle. Not dead and heroic. Get down there and stop complaining! <laughs> Another outsider come to see the boss? <laughs> Mind your manners now, or he'll throw you in the pit. Crying eye. Let's not do anything suspicious while it's watching. Get food. What are they delaying for? Can't we just swarm the forest? Drow wants to know exactly where those adventurers came from. What are they doing? Hiding in tri-
Killing someone is one way to get a guard's blood pressure up. You're destined for the cells, if you're lucky. Deep and move.
Ha <laughs> Finding my way.
finding my way. Pardon the viscera. One should cherish all of nature's bounty, but goblin guts are quite far down the list. You aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. <laughs> a true friend of nature. Or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe thanks. I am the druid Halson. Parasites in your head that... You mean you have one of them? Father, preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? The mind flares spawn. But something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Hmm. That looks very alien. As alien as the Mind Flayers, they do not belong on this world. You weren't speaking lightly when you said you needed help. Let me tell you what I know. I've been studying these parasites for a while now. Ever since I discovered these so-called true souls are infected with them, someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic, which means I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. I didn't find what I came here for, a way to remove the tadpoles. But I found the next best thing. I found out where they come from. That must be where these enchantments are placed on them. And it's where you'll find your cure. No, this is... different. Altered. The magic used is beyond me. It's either not of this world or so ancient as to be lost to even nature's memory. Patience. I can't just snap my fingers. But I know where the solution almost certainly lies. I overheard that the cultists are sending all of their captives to Moonrise Towers. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. If you want to find a cure, you must head there and discover how the tadpoles are being manipulated. I wish I could, but there's still work I've yet to finish. Blood I've yet to spill. I have no right to ask more of you, but if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. My thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. Rare is the beast that survives decapitation. Help me eliminate the Drow Minthara, the Hobgoblin Draw Ragslin, and that perversion of a priestess, Gut. They are the ones holding these parasites together. Remove them, and nature will cure itself. Be warned. My presence could make things more difficult. I can only restrain my bear form so much. I won't be able to help but attack goblins. 
If I join you, we'll likely have to slaughter this entire place. You may want to use discretion when approaching the goblin leaders. So be it. May Sylvanus lend us nature's fury. Legs protrude from the hole. A failed escape, it seems. The body comes loose, revealing a tunnel. Perhaps you can escape where he failed. Still blocked, but should be easy enough to clear. tell you, the scrying eye was looking at me all strange. Right. What would some drow wizard in Moonrise want to look at you for? Certainly you won't be because of your beautiful eyes. What do they need to be looking at any of us for is what I'm saying.
time to waste.
swift as my feet can carry me. watching me. It might be useful. I'm 
coming through. Nothing will stand in my way. Let's end this. Swords meet sorcery. One day, I'll catch a break. have seen everything.
How much longer will this take? To new horizons. be on my way.
Slow down. Gone with the weave. Finding my way.
Don't waste a step. Ready. What path lies before me?
the blade will not bend. be on my way. You did it! You actually did it! The leader's dead! <laughs> Praise Sylvanus! No, that's not right. Praise you, my friend. The Grove owes you a debt beyond measure. Killing's never my first choice, but those three were too dangerous to leave alive. Let's get out of this pit firstly. Return to the Grove. I'll make my own way there. I can see to some matters there, and we can discuss what comes next amidst more bucolic surroundings than here. Yeah, 
Give it a shot. Waste a step. A grave mistake. <laughs> Move. 
rescued here, I hope. It's been a long day. I'll need to rest soon. These boots have seen everything. Seems simple enough. Seems like the best way. Step forward.
coming through. Deep and move. Two 
No time to waste. Swift as my feet can carry me. to have a word. Notice a shiver run through his feathered coat. Fear, a desperate longing for the safety of his nest. But his mother is gone, taken. All that's left are these creatures. The cub tilts his head. He's considering it. He runs away. Only time will tell if he'll reappear. Poor creature. I hope it can follow my scent to camp. <laughs> 